Hey, 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 it's Kagano Pirio with Kage Speaks. Alright, so, you already know that I'm a brony, probably from early video, just beforehand. So, I want to show you what team I play for. The new Lunar Republic. Always have been. As you know, Luna is my favorite pony and princess, so. Awesome! Alrighty, so, I just forgot what I was going to talk about. That's what happens when you don't sleep in a night. Well, it's extremely hot down here, uh, and I'm in a basement. Go figure. Um, I'm visiting some family, which is my father. Um, and yes, yeah, so, I was just looking at um, some videos, and my buddy TJ uh, was talking about how he's gonna be making more videos about me and him when he comes back and everything and you know I don't mind that that should be kinda cool to kinda get back up there I haven't made in two weeks and this is actually me making up for it um but yeah so um what's up while what you doing um <laughs> I don't know what to talk about it's like 6.30 in the morning so I'm like uh so I thought I'd make like some random talk video. I wanted to do something about appreciation towards you guys, but it kind of kept sounding like I was drawing on and on and on, and I wouldn't shut up. Anyway, um, so, oh, I could do a little bit of a review, I guess. So I bought the game Deadpool, the new one. Uh, Ta-da! Great freaking game! Jeebus! Like... Of all my stars, uh, oh, my Luna, um, it's just, it's phenomenal. Like, the gameplay is funny, it sticks to the storyline of each character, of comic, um, the, it's, it's very directed towards where Deadpool breaks the fourth wall of reality and talks to the player, um, the, uh, graphics are crazy, even from beginning till end, um, wounding towards him is the same exact thing it's playful it's funny um it's graphic it's gory it's it's deadpool it's who he is um who has been one of my favorite unscrupulous heroes from all time from the weapon x program uh based in canada I want to give middle fingers to the camera saying, yeah, something good from Canada other than that Bieber shit and, and all that crap. But, anyway, um, uh, a lot of people, okay, I want to get this straight. A lot of people think that I am of homosexuality, and hey, I want to be honest, no. I am not homo, I am, I am not gay in any way shape or form ish all right so i have my patches here and there and geez do i look good in a dress but i'm pansexual so i wanted to lay that out there i do like guys i do like girls i like guys and girls of any type as long as they're of age and human so let's get those straight um anyway enough about that a lot of people have just been saying it, like, what, is, does it come off in the way that I talk, is it the way that I flare my hands, is it that I can be very flamboyant at times, and, you know, things can get a little rowdy, um, but, you know, ow, hit my funny bone, <laughs> these two fingers just went numb for a second, but it's, it's weird, why do, why do people judge on what your sexuality is based off of actions you do. I found out someone in my family just found out that he was recently gay and he's been with his boyfriend for a while and damn straight, they're a beautiful couple together. They're awesome, they're cool. Jeez, I looked up to him when I was a kid. Like, like I wanted to be exactly like him and well, he's successful, he's in love, he's happy and man, he came out probably looking straighter than I've ever met. Baseball player, hockey player, all this sort of stuff. And he was he was probably one of the manliest men I ever knew of when I was a child. And, well, heck, what happened? 
He told me, he came out, he actually told me. He was jealous of the fact that I came out before he did. I told my parents I was bisexual, because I didn't know what I was at that time. And I said I was bisexual, and I said it flat out, like I didn't care. Because I didn't. My family never mattered to me at most, because, you know, I got in a lot of fights with them, and a lot of issues, and I just kind of spun it out, and he's just like, I am jealous, I am so angry with the fact that you were able to come out, but I wasn't, and he, he told me first, he told me that he was, he was gay, and I felt flattered, I was like, wow, the guy I looked up to for so long is jealous of me. Because I came out with something that was who I am. And I thought he was always that guy that always came out for who he was. No, he, he freaked. Oh. It, was, it, was, it was like a really passionate, happy moment for me. And... <laughs> Sorry, dust. <laughs> Fluffs. <laughs> anyway... Um, but yeah, it was kind of cool finding out that, you know, someone in my family was, was gay and that, and they went to Pride and they've been going to Pride ever since. And, uh, I, I really do like the person he's with and, you know, it's, it's, it's really, really awesome to me. That's all I gotta say. And, um, you know, I'm going off on a tangent with these things. I just jump from video games to... To, uh, sexuality to all sorts of stuff and bronies and pegasisters and oh my god <laughs> pegasus ponies alicorns oh my <laughs> but um <laughs> so uh mr captain jack uh mr tj himself uh wants to do a couple videos again so i'm down to do them um same thing goes for uh nix uh, she's down to do some videos and stuff. I've been more, I've been thinking about doing some industrial video stuff, getting some people to get some gas masks, some goggles, some gothic clothing, uh, or whatever they want to dress as, and we just go around wherever. Or you get you guys make your own video, and you know I take them and I make a compilation, put it into one thing. Hey, you know that sounds pretty good to me. I do the editing, you just hand me the vid. Uh, and I can see if I can intertwine the music with it of what you're doing, um, your dance too. If not, then, uh, and you don't really have a specification, I'll try to keep it to a really awesome heavy style song. Maybe bring in some Combi Christ, uh, some Eyes and Funk, uh, Cyborg Corp, uh, the list goes on and on and on. But, um, um, Error Terror, uh, uh, sorry, or Terror Error. Yeah, I don't remember which way it goes, but, um, anyway, uh, all these different sorts of things, and, wow, I'm actually seeing it become day. <laughs> I haven't seen that in a while, um, but, uh, man, I feel, I feel woo. Imagine if I passed out on camera, just, yeah, so how you guys, <laughs> it's just like, there's a 30 minute video of me passed out cold. <laughs> it's like, did I just watch this guy just die? can't poke him with a stick, he's on screen. So, let's poke it. It's like, what are you doing? Is he alive over there? <laughs> no, um... <laughs> I think, like, one of you guys are tripping out, some of the stoners in the crowd, or whatever you guys are watching me on, just like, oh, man. This guy's a trip, bro. Did you see what he's talking about? <sighs> Trust me, I've been there. <laughs> I used to watch YouTubers all the time. I'd watch PewDiePie and be like, <laughs> he said butt, and all that sort of stuff. <laughs> it was weird. A lot of people relate me to Deadpool at times because I'm very ADHD kind, and whenever something boring happens, I'm like, <laughs> so dramatic, and I just like, <laughs> like start playing around where I just kill myself and like, just <laughs> and stuff, but that's no joke. Um, I'm gonna be all angry with you for a video. <laughs> no, um, I look like a duck there, like quack, quack, quack. Uh, I don't know. I'm <laughs> sleep depravity does a lot to the body, mind and soul, soul, soul. 
Souls can be, uh, you know, you can say soul in any weird way you want to. Just like, soul, or soul, or do some, like, Nazi zombie stuff. Fetch me their souls. Right, and it's like so raw. Like, it can be the most metal thing you hear, or like the most lucid, or you can say it in a po uh, poetic way where, your eyes captivate me, where I can look deep within your soul as cold as ice as it melts into this lucid water where I tread to your mind's eye. And, and I don't know, just came up with whatever came to mind at that moment, but uh, poetry! Oh my god, you could be in the most depressive state being like, you cut me with the knife of denial and pain and as I watch as the blood trickles down, I see myself, my soul, my essence burrow deep within my mind and die. And it's so, so brutal. Or it could be so loving where your heart, it envelops me in a new light, in a new way, bringing happiness and peace upon my heart and soul and my very being becomes so alive and sort of stuff so it's kind of cool but i'm already at 11 minutes holy um i swear you guys are watching this and just going jeez i swear to god he's not tired he's just doing crack no i've just been i've been up so long now uh it's been a day i don't know anymore save me from myself my mind is playing tricks on me but i never know anymore because you never know what's going on in the mind of another person because you could be insane you could be lifelike and i bet i'm really close to the screen how you doing how you doing what you doing you like it no <laughs> this is creepy i swear to god you guys are like okay you know should i report this do i flag it it's not sexual it's downright creepy <laughs> fucking people aren't just like oh my god you're such a creep no <laughs> I don't care but it's it's cool like I don't know I'm ah 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 I licked <laughs> I was flipping it yeah yeah ugh anyway um but hey 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 uh, so, I've been talking to you, I need to shave, jeez, this is probably one of the videos where I actually have a beard-ish thing coming on, I feel like I'm shave, uh, doing No Shave November, jeez, but it's July, so I think I'm a couple months away, it's practice, you know, it's practice, but, um, you know, maybe I should look like this, and I'm looking right into the camera, um, so this blue I'm getting rid of at some point. I'm really sick of it. Um and all but I wanted to say thank you for watching. Uh if you don't know who I am, I'm Kage no Pirio for Akage Speaks. A uh, new thing that I've been doing. Um recently I've been calling my followers or my sub subscribers why was that word so hard to figure out? I was thinking like my prophets, my scribes, scribe, scribe, subscriber. There we go. <laughs> Took me some weird biblical mumbo jumbo to kind of get me to remember. But anyway, thank you all for watching. If you uh, liked it, then leave a like and favorite. Uh, if you enjoyed, um, subscribe. Um, to further me out there, shoot my shit out there, Twitter me, Facebook it, um, you know, vibe it, whatever. I love it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, but, um, yeah, so you've been talking to a brony this whole time, so if you didn't know, uh-oh, now you do. Um, and, uh, if you didn't know, I'm also a cyber goth, so, oh my, new information! Uh, probably not, because you've maybe either watched all my episodes before, or the fact that you're watching this now kind of cultivates the fact that maybe you were typing that up and this came up in that sort of description thing, tag, whatever, it's down there. It tells me things! Well, no, uh, <laughs> I'm wacky. I've been trying to end this video for a bit, and it might end itself, because my phone is being weird recently. So, 
thank you all for watching. I said again and again and again. Jesus. Um, and I hope you enjoyed this uh, Kage Speaks. And uh, leave me a like. Leave me a favorite. Leave me a subscribe. Tell me what you liked about this. And if you uh, if you farted during this, you know, you know excuse yourself. And uh, if you... If you, you know, enjoyed every single moment, give it a share. Share it around, you know. I like being out there and stuff, and it actually does help me a lot. And I love each and every single one of you. And I'm not being some fake YouTube persona. Trust me. A lot of people can say that uh, and actually show you who I am. All right? So, uh, thank you. And uh, I love y'all. So, sweet, yeah, you know, gorgeous nightmares all the way. So, auf Wiedersehen. And keep it real. Alright. Bye, my nightmare.